This is Sway. 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 In the morning. In the morning. In the morning. Shake your body. Wake your fuck ass up. Crust. Oh, man, we got two fellas here to this morning. Tracy G, who well, I've, I've had the opportunity to hang out with, you know, you as you know. Yes. And no stranger to the show. Uh, and it came up to Oakland, and I had to protect them. <laughs> from what? <laughs> from women. <laughs> was, was, nobody was trying to rob them. <laughs> so they still their virginity. But other than that, no. you know, um, I, you know, we had the boy Illinois on here earlier, who is um, really excited about the group that's here right now. One of the things I like about him is what I like about them. Uh, these guys have been building their own fan base for a while now. How many years has it been? Man, about. About five. About five years, these dudes have been kind of moving sort of under the radar um, and doing what it takes to meet the like blue collar artists, in my opinion. Mm -hmm. They haven't had a whole lot of gigantic breaks. You know, even them being here in New York City right now, because they got a big show tonight at SOBs. Mm. Um, and the way they got here, Tracy G, is mm -hmm. no, they didn't catch a flight. Nope. Mm. No, they didn't get on the Greyhound. Uh uh. Mm -mm. These gentlemen saved up their coins and drove from California to be here this morning with us. Sheesh. I'm talking about Jake and Papa, who are mm -hmm. here with us this morning. Welcome to the show. Oh, damn. Uh -huh. Talk about hey, well, the damn, hustling. Sweat. What you know. I'm supposed to say after that? You, listen, man, <laughs> we have to, my role is to reward those who are dedicated to the culture, musically yeah. mm. and otherwise. When I see people work hard, and I know you don't have a big machine behind you. I know everything is coming out of pocket. Mm -hmm. I know you drove out here to save money yeah. <laughs> because right. the flights were too expensive. Right. Yeah, yeah. Ain't no secret. Yep. That and, yeah. and at the same time, you have music that you've made that is better than the music that is played on radio. Oh, more man. so. Thank even you. though you guys are starting to get play now oh, yeah. and get recognition now, um, I, I thought... It's our it's our duty to give you this exposure on this platform. Welcome, Jake and Papa. Thank here. you so much, and gentlemen. Appreciate Blessings, that. Yeah. Got a new uh, project out, right? Oh yes, yeah, sir. that sexual warfare. Is sexual out right warfare. Now. You know, mm. hey, that thing is out right now, and it's free ninety nine for the people. FTP. You understand me? What can where can they get it? SoundCloud.com slash Jake and Papa. J A K E A N D P A P A. You mm -hmm. guys are real brothers, right? Yeah, real twenty brothers. months apart. How many months? Twenty months. Twenty wow. months apart. Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. Any other siblings? Yeah, it's thirteen of us all yeah. together. Grip. Papa was a Rolling Stone. Okay. Also said, was it the mo same about? mother? <laughs> hey, <check. laughs> nah, nah, yeah, we got look. two little siblings in Mexico that we only met once. You so your me? your pops is he? Uh, he he doesn't here. believe in contraception. Or? <laughs> I guess, nah, man. You, you know what's crazy? It's actually fourteen. We got one on the way. Oh yeah, by your pops. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Damn, that sperm is healthy. You know yeah. what I'm talking about? Damn, how old is your pops? He old, man. He too old to be doing that. I think he damn, <laughs> he damn near 60. He you probably fucking to your music. So, you know? Yeah, right. That means it's working. He probably put on 187 and right. murder the coochie, right? Right on. All right. Come up. Do that. Uh, <laughs> so did y'all grow up with your father? Not really. He was there um, up until like in and out like four or five. Then he went away like when I was like 10. Mm -hmm. And then he came back around 14. But it's never really like, you know, our mom was our, our foundation and our support system and everything. Both sides. I said she played every role like an Eddie Murphy movie. Yeah. <laughs> and the, where did y'all grow up? Like in, in L.A.? or uh, yeah. Right outside of L.A. in the San Fernando Valley. Uh -huh. Call it the 818. Yeah. For your other siblings, are they like musically inclined too? Like did, were they yeah. upset that they didn't get to join the group? Nah, yeah. Um, everybody's musically inclined. It just runs in our blood. Like our dad was a singer, so he taught us how to sing. Our grandma was a singer. Great grandma was an opera singer. Uncles play instruments. Like everybody is pretty much musically inclined. We just mm -hmm. decided to go a certain route. Yeah, I just think know? it has to do it because we grew up with our mom and my mom's kids. You know, we have an older sister and a younger brother, but we're the only ones who do music out of those four. Mm -hmm. So you know, and we're twenty months apart, so it just worked like that. Do y'all play instruments? You know, we dabble. Piano. You know, we dabble on that on that keyboard. <laughs> uh -huh. You know, I, I twinkle a little bit on the keyboard. <laughs> you know, I'm trying to learn guitar, but you know, it's tough. It's tough. Yeah. Your shows are super hype, man. Thank when you. When I watch your shows, it's like, how do all these people even know them? You know? <laughs> <laughs> did you find yeah. yourself having to, like, prove yourself on stage? Like, what was your, like, oh, yeah. your, your, your worst response you ever got from a stage performance? You know what's crazy is the worst to me is having, like, 13 people show up. You yeah. know? Mm. So, but once those 13 people are there, we're going to rock like it's 13,000. No matter who's in the building, they're going to end up fucking with Jake and Pablo because that's okay. just how we get out, you know? Uh, I don't think we ain't never got booed or nothing, you know, so because we we really lived this. Yeah. Um, 
luckily we've been like you know had the opportunity of getting on stage with like a lot of dope people in LA and all over so just kind of like trying to steal fans. Mm -hmm. Sexual warfare is the name yeah. of the project. Y'all, 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 y'all performed in front of Michael Jackson before. Yeah, yeah man, yeah, Mike, that was a great experience. It was man. like a uh, heal the world type of, you know, had a bunch of artists on stage singing uh -huh. for him. So we sang that. We think it was for his 50th birthday. And did he did he say anything to you? He was just like, you know, he was just vibing, and then afterwards we got to shake his hand and say what's up. His hand was hella cold. But, <laughs> oh, God damn, I know Michael that Jackson, means. yeah. Michael Jackson's hand was cold. Cold. You where, know what's where, where did he place it, though? Where did he put his oh, hand? Oh, no, no. Come on now. That's the king now. Oh, okay, all right. Go Shit. ahead. Hey, I got a better story about Michael Jackson. When we was, we was little, we went to the Soul Train Music Awards in 1995 for a special performance for him, and we got to go on stage again while he performed You Are Not Alone. And I had on like this old school like Apple cap, driving cap. Yeah. And when they ushered all the kids off, he ran off the stage and came past me and was like, touched my head and was like, nice hat, kid. And ran off. <laughs> Damn, I was like, man. what? And That's the rest dope. is history. Man. Jake and Papa, <laughs> <laughs> sexual warfare. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I see where the inspiration came from yeah. here. Uh, uh, no, no, hold up, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, all right. Uh, I want to, okay, so here, I want to play a song. Which one do I want to play? Mm. I want to play that 187. Is that okay? Yeah, oh, let's yeah. get it. Featuring sure. Casey Veggie. Shout out to Casey. Okay. Uh, yeah. And it was produced by? Fayo and Chill, the homies. The homies. Okay, yeah. this is 187. Uh, 187 by Jake and Papa. Whoop. Sexual Warfare is the project. They're performing at SOBs tonight. Mm -hmm. We're going to open up the phone lines. If you don't know who they are, get to know them. Ask them anything. And if you do, call us. 888-742-334. Hey, hey. That was featuring Casey Veggie's mm -hmm. 187. Hey, hey can, can, who wrote that song? Oh, yeah, we did. You know, we write everything. Y'all write everything. Yeah, right? every, oh, went, oh, man. Can I hear the lyrics? Can you just say the lyrics of the first verse? Yeah, it goes, um. Hey, girl, hey, girl. You know you killing that. You know I need that. Whoa, Lord. Hey, girl, hey, girl. Your body on my head list. Can I get a witness? Ain't nobody dope as you're so fresh, so clean. Your body looks straight out of King Magazine. Champagne pouring all around the team. And all I want to think about is making you scream like, you gonna have me catch a case now. Panties falling down your waist now. Click bang when I see a clear shot Cause it's murder time when I feel it get out So we creeping, yeah Just creep it on the down low And I'ma make it climax when I take it to the top Cause it's 187 when I'm hitting that spot I'm up <laughs> Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. Wasn't that a clever way of saying I'm gonna kill that coochie? Ain't <laughs> <laughs> that, that, that right? Yeah, man. I'm gonna kill it, man. That's, I'm gonna kill it. That's uh, <laughs> make love, not war, baby. There it is. Sexual you know? warfare is the exactly. name of the project. Hey, hey we that, feel like if everybody were just inside making a little more love, there'd be less time for hate. Exactly. You know? Wow, we, man. We can literally save the world by fucking more. You know, Damn, how long y'all be fucking for? I mean, this as is a lifestyle, you know. But I mean, but like one session, like if you as long as it takes to get the job done, it depends. You know, some you know, a lot of women <laughs> talk a lot of a lot of stuff, but it'd be the women that be tapping out most of the time. You yeah, know? I had that problem too. You know, <laughs> um, you know? well, hello, it's I interesting. <laughs> yeah, uh, hello, y'all, so y'all, y'all take. You know, fucking, you, you talk about it like it's an occupation. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's like, a lifestyle. I mean, when it comes to <laughs> when it comes to you know? man and woman, like our job as man and woman is to make the other species, you know, feel good. Your loved one, make them feel good. If not, somebody else is going to do it. He says species. Mm. Wow, mm -hmm. man. You, these dudes are focused. Right. This, is, this is erotica are, 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 you, are you in relationships? Yeah. Married to the music, Sway. Come on. Matt, you know? but, but they married to the music. R&B <laughs> <laughs> So how many loved ones y'all got? Oh uh, uh, man, I you think know the whole crazy? Team JP is our loved ones. You know, everybody who supports us and comes out to the show and buy them records, those are our girlfriends right there. Come Even with fresh guy, panties. Uh, the, the ladies. Oh, the ladies. Come uh, on, Sway. <laughs> um, <laughs> let me get back to the music. 187 yeah. reminds me of a song from the, the past because they, yeah. they used to talk around uh, um, the actual subject matter. You know, with the description, you know, like it, it would be a lot of analogies or yeah. similes or, you know, just parallels to actually saying straightforward, yeah. I'm going to kill the coochie. Exactly. Uh, <laughs> do do y'all think about that as, you know, because R&B is just so blatant now. Yeah, yeah. yeah man, right. that's a crazy uh, point because Sean from Boys to Men said something not too long ago saying that uh, the music being so blatant takes away the richness of it. It takes away mm. the culture of it. You know, you can write a song, you can write a million songs about love because you can talk about it in so many different ways. But mm -hmm. if you just say, I love you, it's kind of like, okay, but what else? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Compare it to the flowers, compare it to the clouds, compare it to the stars, and you can talk about love in a million different ways. 
Yeah. You know, that's true creativity. That's what then that's the approach you take. Yeah. Your, your, how do you think your sound has evolved over the years? Because the, when I'm listening to this project, it doesn't sound like the first things I've heard that Nikki was sending me. Yeah. Um, well, Athena's erotica was the, the start of this erotica mm-hmm. R&B that we was, you know, trying to carve out. And after that, we dropped a song called I Got It and Leave Me, which was more turn up type mm-hmm. of music. And we saw the, you know, the the love that that got. So sexual warfare, our, our, uh, our objective was to fuse the gap between Athena's erotica and I Got It. So that's what we got. Okay, so this is the hybrid. Okay, yeah, see, that's why I could, I could sit right here and this is like where I'm at. Yeah. yeah. Okay, I'm a hybrid of erotica and, and, and what you just said. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, yeah. uh, so what I want to do, I want to play uh, Starless now, and this is also on Red Light Come Special, on. Rob Markman's um, podcast. podcast that Shout he does. Uh, and um, I like this song too, Jacob Popper here, and I hey. want to ask you guys if, if you can to do something a cappella after this, uh, all right? Automatic. 888-742-3345. Jake and Papa. Woo. Yeah. Starless. Oh, Sway in the morning. Trumpet dude. Yeah, yeah. Featuring yeah. Trumpet dude. Much love to Trumpet dude in day one. Yeah. <laughs> trumpet dude. Yeah. Your last name right. right there. Hey, he came through with his trumpet in the briefcase. Yeah. yeah. On some <laughs> on some bleak Gilliam type shit. He did that in one take. Did Just he really? One no. take, bro. One take. Jake and Papa, have been, they've been around for a couple of years now, and you may not be familiar, p- perhaps you are, but these dudes have not only uh, great music, they have an electrifying stage show. Yeah, mm-hmm. thank you. Um, thank you. you guys have a lot of energy, mm. but you're giving this project away for free. Yes. Free 99. Why? At what point do you sell it? You know, we sold the last one. Yeah. We sold the thing is erotica, and we felt like this, it's time for us to connect to the people in the easiest way possible like there's so many people out here doing work for the business and it's all so business savvy it looks so great to the industry but what are you doing for the people mm-hmm. it's the people out there like you said you just said like being that servant that that middleman to for the people mm-hmm. we want to be for the people the industry is cool you know but the industry is a facade you know we want to be for the people the people are what's real that's the only and, thing that lasts yeah that's what lasts so even tonight the show is free Get it to the people, man. SOBs. If yeah, you're in exactly. New York City and Tri State area, come on down to SOBs tonight. They'll be performing. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. I'm curious to know since you guys are brothers, what type of roles do you guys, you know, take when it comes to the creation, when it comes to maybe the business side? Is one person more savvy than the other? Like, do you guys ever just like bump heads on shit? Of course. I mean, of course, there's going to be disagreements, but, you know, above everything is respect. So mm-hmm. if you have that, you good. You know, the, as far as the creative process, we got a nice balance. Mm-hmm. Um, we just, you know, whoever comes with the idea first, it's like, you know, the other one takes a back seat. Okay. Do the hook and do the verse. Somebody else will come in, you know. Mm-hmm. The business, we got a great team, Ace and Nikki, the family Imperial. We're doing everything so um, ourselves. So, yeah, we all just come to a common ground and make a business happen. So how do you pay for Trumpet Dude? <laughs> if everything is being given away for free. You know, actually, yeah. Trumpet, Trumpet, well, we gave him a little something, but Trumpet dude actually show love, came through and show love. We got him a little something to eat, you know, pay uh-huh. for his parking. And we've been building a lot of relationships. You know, we, we work with the people who love it like we love it. Uh-huh. Yeah. All right. Uh, Jake and Papa are here, 888-742-3345. Yeah. We're going to go to Cali. Sher- Sherry is on the line. Sherry, what up? Is it Shari or Sherry? It's, it's Shari. Shari, Shari, good morning. How you doing, Shari? Shari? Good morning. Good. How are How is everybody? Bless. Right. Bless. Good. I just had a question for Jake and Papa. What's I up? wanted to know if you guys could work with anybody past or present that you haven't worked with already. Who would you work with? Like mm-hmm. top two, one dead, one alive. Ooh, one dead, one alive for each of us. One dead and one alive. Yeah. Lord okay. Jesus, let's get it. Mm-hmm. You know, you, you want to work with Jesus? No. Hey, <laughs> hey, I'm, hey, I'm, I'm trying to work hey. with him every day. So, okay. You know, <laughs> who you got, Jake? There you go. I'm gonna go with Miles Davis, past, right, and present. I'm gonna say Lana Del Rey. Mm, I love Lana. Lana's the shit. I'm yeah, a, yeah. Okay. I'm gonna go yeah. past. I'm gonna go Donny Hathaway. Um, nice. In present, I'll say Kendrick Lamar. Y'all nice. haven't worked with Kendrick yet? Nah, not, not yet. yet. It's coming. I feel One like day. y'all worked with everybody in LA. Not <laughs> yet, man. We we you making know? our rounds, but yeah, yeah we trying to get to Kendrick. Sorry, sure. great question. You're a citizen. Thank Sway you. Morning. Thank All right, you, we got Ray from the D, Detroit. What up, Ray? Ray. What's up, man? What up? What's, What's popping poppin'? with you, Ray? Say what's up to Jake and Papa. What's up, Jake and Papa, man? What's, What's up? poppin'? Hey, dude, y'all got it, man. I don't think y'all should be giving it away for free, man. <laughs> y'all got it. Thank we you, wasn't thank up, you. I wasn't up on y'all down here, but now I am, man. Much love, love. thank you. I'm y'all a fan, bro. Appreciate Ooh. that, Ray. We're going to be out to the D soon, man. Pull up on us. I got you. All right, man. You be careful, man. man. You're going to tell somebody from the D to pull up on you. Oh, man. <laughs> it's love, though. It's love. Okay. All right.
right. Hey, All you right. quick with those fingers. Hungry in the D. I know. I've been there. Mm -hmm. All right. Aaliyah is there. Uh, Aaliyah's uh, from Atlanta. What's up, Aaliyah? Good morning. How Aaliyah. are you? ATL, hey, shout it. Hey, I'm good. I just got out of class. Mm. <laughs> what grade? What, what school do you go to? I go to Georgia State. Oh, okay. What year are you? I'm a junior. A junior. Nice. So you put some work in, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I got some semesters in. That's what's mm. up. Did you declare your major yet? Uh, yeah, I'm a biochem major. A biochem yeah. major. Yeah. And, and, well, you know, uh, these guys are uh, they into biology yeah, too. Yeah. 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 You know, I, 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 chemistry. <laughs> Well, definitely. <laughs> you know, they want to they want to work with your uh, with your uh, symmetry. <laughs> wow. You know. All right, Aaliyah, so what would you like to say? What do you think of these guys? Jacob Parker. Oh, you guys are too dope. Like I'm really big on like West Coast music right now. Mm. Like I'm I, I'm glad that y'all are on the show because I never heard y'all but now man, I'm on SoundCloud right now. Yeah, uh, hey, go get that thing. Love. love to you. Thank yeah. you so much and keep and finish that school, please. We need you out here. Absolutely. Much okay. love. Biochem. You're a citizen, That's Aaliyah. Sway in the morning. All right. Tell mm. your tell your classmates. Rico in North Carolina. What up, Rico? Rico. What up, D? What up, D? Sway. How's it going? What's up with your family? How you been? Nah, I've just been thinking about Tracy all day since I've seen a picture online. Oh, <laughs> boy. Uh -huh. Yeah, man. And then she's going to make this. Hey, listen, Rico, you know she got a new project coming out where she's going to be doing an album worth of affirmations, and then she's going to give you some masturbation affirmations as well. <laughs> Mm. Oh, yeah, that shit. Balance, <laughs> yeah, yo. Right. Hey, so you got a question for Jake and Papa? <laughs> yeah, actually, um, no disrespect to them. I've never heard of them. I've been out the game for a little bit, you know what I mean? Just got back on Sirius and everything, so I can catch back up. I wanted to know if they got, you know, like a website or something. You can check them out. Oh, yeah. You know what I mean? Get yeah. some tracks and some videos, you know what I'm saying, and all that good shit. Yeah, jakeandpapa.com, man. J-A-K-E-A-N-D-P-A-P-A. That's what's up, man. And thanks in advance for listening, man. Love. That's yeah, yeah. All right, Rico, have a good day. Hey, man, so have y'all ever, like, a, you mean, because you guys have a lot of women that show up to your shows, right? Mm-hmm. I hope so. No. <laughs> um, We know y'all like fucking, because that, that was a big part of the Clearly. first part of the conversation. Oh, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Have y'all as brothers, have you ever shared? Mm. You know, um... Truthfully, man, don't nah, come up here lying. Yeah, yeah, no, it's a, yeah, it's a, a lot of people uh, ask that question. It's, we don't really like that. Yeah. You know, oh, it's, it's gross. It's just like, you know. It was but smart. you never accidentally banged, banged out somebody that your brother banged out? We had girls that tried. And wow. it was just like, you know, nah. I mean, I remember when I was in the seventh grade, a girl kissed me on the cheek that my brother liked, and I came back kind of like bragging about it. My mom like grabbed my, my shirt, like, don't ever mess with a girl that your brother likes. And I was just like, ever since then, it was like, nah, yeah. not doing it. It's not worth it damn, for what? Damn. That's There's just so, too many out here. Yeah, There's way too many out here. Yeah. What about if you guys both like the same chick? How do you decide who goes after her? You flip a coin. <laughs> no, I'm just playing. No, I'm just playing. Um, it's, it just never really happens. Real players it seems, get chose anyway. Yeah, yeah, you know, you just let it play out, and before you know it, it's just moving so smoothly every time. <laughs> this guy, you know, <laughs> he got the straight up nighttime voice. <laughs> uh -oh. Yeah, y'all ever perform with Chris Brown? Nah, no. Nah, we I actually didn't. just got that the other day. Yeah. Hopefully, we'll speak that into existence. He's a dope performer. Yeah, I, I feel like I could see if Chris saw you guys. Yeah. I think you, he would invite you to be on tour. You would probably have yeah. to pay for your own way, but you yeah, know, we hey, that. we could do that. You, you see, we we down. We for out that. here. You feel you know? me? Yeah. Blessings um, to Chris, man. Yeah. That that might have to happen. Man, you know? can let's give everybody a acapella, man, or something, mm -hmm. man, before yeah. I play this last song. Yo, so we about to take it back with this one. Well, let me know if y'all know what this one is. If. <clears throat> If you ever change your mind about leaving, leaving me behind, oh, bring it to me, bring your sweet loving, bring it on home to me, yeah, 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 yeah. I like that, Jake and Papa. Yes, yes. Oh, that's all y'all got? Um, hey, oh, man. hey, actually, <laughs> I know you ain't gonna have us come up here and not have us freestyle or something. Wonder, throw oh. a beat on them, brother. Throw a beat on them, man. Sway in the morning, shade four five. What we got even R and B singers got a freestyle. Yeah. Uh, uh. Shake hey. your pop and sway in the morning. Uh, uh. shade four five. Uh, uh. yeah. Legendary uh, classic uh. beat. Uh. I used to bump them clue tapes on that 164 bus. 
Tiles PJ, the fat Paul Kane and Joe Button. Sick of these niggas trying to act like they know shit. Where were your girl last night? See, you don't know shit. I've been a man since little me. I mean, really, I be snapping, I be snapping like Kobe's Achilles. Man, listen, I've been finessing other niggas' bitches since Diamond was in Players Club. Stripping for tuition. Oh, baddies creeping on the low now. Uh. The way they skate around a man with the tricks. Then slide up in the DMs real quick like sweetness and roll bounce. Uh. Videos twerking. For a whole A count Damn girl Hey I'm a fan girl Say you a real one Well I'm the man girl Sway fuck the ice and baguettes nigga I can put a lock around a chain like Tretch And be fresher than the best nigga Yeah <laughs> Oh yeah Take the popper Take it popper Yeah 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 like that. That was some, some pimpish. You know? I oh, like that. Damn. You that too, man. I'm tired of these rappers who really rap coming on here and not doing shit. What the Don't fuck y'all doing? Uh-oh. You watch to talk to. Talk your man. shit, Let's man. Go. Come on, man. Don't make me do your job for you, bruh, bruh. Papito. I will damn. do it. Do you see that, though? I will do it. <laughs> you be watching, right? A lot Big of... rappers, too. Like, coming on here choking, <laughs> reading off their Blackberries. Ooh, Come on, bruh. Shots. What damn. are we doing? Damn. Mm. Come on, man. That's mm. not allowed? Are we not trying to be the best? Are we trying to be the best or not? If, or if not. not, move out the way and let some real niggas do it. Straight up. Mm. That's coming from an R&B dude, Damn. players. Anyway, <laughs> sexual warfare out right now. Go get that thing for the free. <laughs> <laughs> I like that, about? man. Hey, listen, I'm going to tell you, citizens, with, by, by this time next year, you're going to be like, Damn, he told us. Yeah. He told us. Jake and Papa, time. these dudes Sweet. are going to be around for a long time. Congratulations. Thank sexual you. warfare Blessings. is the name of the project. Check them out at SOBs. How can people reach you, man? Hit the, matter of fact, citizens, hit them up directly. Get on your social media. Yeah, man, mm-hmm. we very uh, hands-on with our Instagram and Twitter. So um, hit us up, Jake and Papa. Instagram, Twitter, slash Jake and Papa, J-A-K-E-A-N-D-P-A-P-A. You can find us anywhere on the internet with typing in that. What did the name Papa come from? They've been calling me that since I was a baby, actually, since I was Papa? born. Yeah, they said that I acted like an old man when I was a baby. So it's a family nickname. Papa. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right, all right, all right man. Good, uh, good work, gentlemen. We're gonna play yeah. a song called "Leave Me" featuring uh, Dub and Karina. Dub, much love, it's my Dub. bro. Okay, Dub is like one of the illest rappers out of the uh, uh, out of L.A. area coming right now. He under that yeah. radar, but he gonna get you soon. Oh, oh yeah, we gonna mm-hmm. do it together too. All right, yeah, we gonna Karina. be performing with Dub soon, actually. Too. Yeah, yeah. The yeah. us and DJ and Dot, we gonna be performing with Dub. So just stay tuned to our social media because that dude is finna change the world and we're gonna change it with him. Yeah, that was the shit. And, and Karina, Karina Passion is actually from out here. She, um, we known her for a long time. We met through Shakir Stewart, rest in peace. Mm. And um, she's just a great vocalist, man. A great girl. vocalist. Yeah. All right, cool. Mm-hmm. All right, Jake and Papa, y'all. Uh, it's called Lee. <laughs> Shape 45.